and reconditioning brake drums. Preparation. Measure the diameter of the brake drum with a brake drum micrometer. Determine if the drum will be within maximum rebore limits after reconditioning. Note, most often the discard diameter is cast into the brake drum, not the maximum machining diameter. Inspect brake drum. Do not attempt to machine a drum that is damaged or in poor condition. Lathe setup. Loosen the boring bar clamp nut and push the boring bar all the way into the clamp. Mount the drum on the arbor using the proper adapters, cones, and spacers. Wrap the drum silencer band snugly around the drum. Be sure it covers up to the right hand edge. Position the cross slide by turning the cross feed hand wheel to its maximum clockwise position. Then back off the cross feed hand wheel two complete turns. Position the boring bar by loosening the boring bar clamp nut and sliding the boring bar inward toward the drum until the tool bit is close to the drum. The boring bar position is changed whenever a drum of different diameter is machined. The entire boring bar clamp may also be swiveled to achieve the best cutting position. Turn the drum by hand to make sure that everything is clear and all components have been secured properly. Turn the lathe on. Advance the tool bit using the crossfeed hand wheel until it just contacts the drum surface momentarily and makes a scratch cut. Loosen the dial lock screw on the crossfeed hand wheel and set the dial to the diameter of the drum as measured with a micrometer.